Hey guys, thanks for joining us. Welcome to uh, BZB Express TV. Uh, today we're going to be covering a new product from BZB Gear called the BZ-UHD-42M. Uh, this device basically is a 4x2 matrix switcher. It can take four HDMI sources and split it into two displays. It's also capable of extracting your audio from your HDMI source. So um, if you have a whole house system, you can actually use the left and right analog output. If you have a surround sound receiver, you can use the optical digital output. Uh, it, the left and right output is going to support your typical PCM 2.0. The optical digital output is going to support your Dolby True HD, uh, DTS 5.1. Um, etc. So pretty much you're covered on this guy uh, depending on you know what you're trying to play your music into either way it's got you good. The switcher supports um, a video resolution of 4k 2k at 60 Hertz uh, chroma sampling is 444 uh, it does stream at 18 gigabytes per second. Um, it actually even supports 3D format. So virtually whatever source you have you can hook it up to this guy and you're gonna have perfect picture. Um, you know, when I think of this unit and I figure, you know, where can I put this? Uh, what comes to mind to me is like a master bedroom and a master bathroom scenario. Uh, many times you have a TV in the bathroom, maybe the wife's uh, sitting in the, in the tub watching TV, you want to watch the football game from the bed. Um, this is a perfect unit, especially if you have like a closet system. You can throw this guy in there, you can control it, she can watch what she wants, you can watch what you want. Um, another scenario maybe would be like a, a cabana, a pool house. Uh, you got a TV inside uh, for maybe the adults watching football, another TV outside, the kids are in the pool. Um, everybody's happy all at once. It's actually really cool. Oh, and, and not to mention, um, many folks have two displays on the same wall, especially gamers. Uh, maybe you got two Xbox hooked up side by side and you can play them. No problem. Watch your buddy and play head on head. That's always a good scenario. Or maybe you just want to watch a football game on one and uh, play games on the other. Um, never hurts to have two TVs personally. It's one of my favorite uh, situations. <laughs> Um, so now let's take a quick look at the operation overall of this system. It does come with a handy dandy little IR remote. Uh, about as simple as it gets. It's got an output A and an output B, one through four inputs, as well as a toggle and auto. Uh, auto is kind of a nice feature as well. Um, so currently we are over here looking at our uh, Avengers. With this guy, as I mentioned, you can extract the audio. So follow me over here. So essentially this is our output A or display one. You got one through four. Just press the button here. Goes through all your inputs. If you want auto, you hold it down for about three seconds and then it will actually go to auto sensing. Same with this guy here. Switches sources, our audio here, A and B. So basically this is where you're gonna extract your audio. If you press this to extract it from A or if you wanna extract the audio from your B output, then you just press it once. It's just a simple toggle. Also, uh, 4K to 1080p. So if you're in a native environment of 1080p displays, you can actually press this guy and it will switch it to both, one or the other. ARC, if you have audio return channel going, you can use this guy. I currently have it hooked up to our receiver using the optical cable. And sound works great. Again, you can ARC this, uh, so it does have audio return channel capabilities. Currently, we're just pipelining it straight into the receiver using the optical cable. Um, other than that, as you can see, switching time is typically between three and six seconds. So we're gonna switch display one or output A. We'll go over to our next source, um, which I believe is our top gun, yes. So you see top guns here, now we have it on both screens. Let's switch our uh, display number two to our other source, which is our Blu-ray player. And as you can count, it's probably about eh, five seconds for that switch. Um, while we're there, we may as well take a look at the computer. Again, about eh, four or five seconds, pretty typical. Switch it over to output A, display number one for our computer as well. And again, three, four, five, about five seconds. It's basically plug and play right out of the box, connect your HDMI sources, connect your displays. Um, you know, you got 4K or 1080p, either way it's gonna work for you. It'll actually downscale 4K to 1080p if all you have is 1080p TVs. Uh, which is a convenient functionality and it's actually on the front panel as well as on the remote. 
So um, that's pretty much it, guys. If you got any questions, feel free to hit up our sales team, our tech support, leave a comment. Uh, we always appreciate any likes we get. Um, subscribe to our channel. It's definitely much appreciated and helps us with feedback and get a better understanding of what our customers are looking for and what they need. So again, thanks guys. Have a good one and we'll see you next time.